Welcome back, agents. Secret Agent Stash here. We are at GIA headquarters, the gaming intelligence agency. It's Big Time Wednesday. It is Big Time Wednesday. Big Time Wednesday. How many times I got to say it? Um, <laughs> I don't know how you guys feel about Big Time. You know, I would love to hear your guys' audience opinion in the comments. I've been playing Big Time now for the last couple months. Every Wednesday, we jump on, man. We play with the friends. And, you know, this is one of those things where, you know, when you have a community of people who follow you, they watch your content, they look at your live streams, you know, is this a game that people want to continue watching? They want to continue seeing content about, right? They want to keep continue learning uh, new tricks and things from, getting updates from, like we're doing every Wednesday, getting giveaways from. And if you guys are still interested in big time, please put a comment and let me know. Let me know uh, in the comments for the video. I'd really love to hear from you guys. Pop your collars and give old Stash some of that input. Uh, but yeah, so we're going to jump in uh, with our friend Custom TV here in just a second and go play some big time with him and do some prestige portals. Uh, I see we got a couple agents in chat, Agent Vic, Agent Slander, 
Team TNT, Lord Misfit hanging out with us. The Scotch Hunter, what's up, man? Good to see you as well. But yeah. Uh, like always, hey, we're doing a rare space giveaway, an NFT giveaway today for a rare small space. So if you guys want to uh, get in on that, that giveaway, make sure you stay tuned. You got to watch because I'm going to do it sometime in the middle of the stream. And um, and yeah, it's only going to be open for a couple minutes. So keep that in mind. It's it, you got like three minutes usually is what we leave it open for. So get your open loot usernames ready. Rare small space giveaway. I think they're like at a hundred bucks right now. One hundred and fifty bucks. Uh, let's go take a look. Actually, why not? Why don't we just go? Why don't we just go look? Uh, let me pull up the marketplace real quick here. All right, so here at the website for Big Time, their marketplace, and we're looking for space. Wait, did I pass? Oh, no, I did pass it. Let's see what they're going for right now. A hundred bucks, boom! Right, I, I almost had it right on the nose. One hundred one dollars is what they're going for. Uh, the price has definitely dropped here over the last month and a half or so. It's definitely dropped a good amount here over the last month and a half, but still uh, a really great, uh, uh, you know, NFT to win today, hundred dollar value. And that gets you started with your journey in big time beyond just the free to play stuff, right? Free, free to play. Still fun. Looking forward to actual release. Yeah. So I get some new people. I feel that Scotch Hunter. I feel that man. Uh, I think that we need new content too. really the, the scope of the game itself is fairly redundant still. I think that's always been big time's problem. Is it with any MMORPG, you really need a good amount of content. What's going on, Blade? Yeah, the 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 new the big update that we're all been we've been talking about every Wednesday essentially <laughs> is coming here, and that should hopefully help with a lot of those things. Adding a new town, adding new features, possibly PvP. Not interested in big time content because you don't play big time. So that's a good input there, Schlander. I mean, I think that, you know, a lot of times that's kind of becomes the issue, right? With someone who does variety content, variety streaming. Whereas you maybe started watching me for one thing and I started doing something else. You're just like, eh, I'm not interested in it anymore. Or you stop playing that game, then you become uninterested in it as well. And, and I can totally see that. I can totally see that. Uh, you know, hopefully I think that we have enough people in the, in, in the community who like the big time stuff and want to keep seeing it. If not, maybe we stop doing big time Wednesdays. I don't know. I, I, I enjoy playing it, but I don't know. I don't, I don't know if we want to stop doing it. So agent tasty. What's going on, man? Good to see you. Okay. And then real quick, another thing before I go uh, and move, uh, get into the game, there is a lucky draw mystery box giveaway going on right now for big time that they're running. This is, this is one of their open loop giveaways and uh, you got it ends in eight days. So just so you know, this is a great way to get a get a chance at a mystery box. There's a thousand of them, so you, I mean you probably have a pretty decent chance at getting one of these. This common mystery box. I'm gonna put uh, the link in chat here for you guys, so you have it. Yeah. So they're doing so. So basically, and they're doing a big giveaway. So they say you got to do all these things, but really, all you gotta do is just come here and enter here. <laughs> Just FYI, man. Yeah, just FYI. Yeah, I can't enter them because my Twitter link won't link. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, you do have to link your Twitter. Keep that in mind, agents. You have to link your Twitter for this. Right, let's go. Uh, let's go join custom and the rest of the boys in there and jump in and see if we can't get in playing some big time. Yo, what is going on, fellas? Perfect. Perfect timing. Perfect up, timing. An agent always has perfect timing. Don't you know this custom? Perfect always. It's like the bomb. Was it the red wire or the green wire? The red wire or the green wire? And Jeff walks up and it says neither and clips the yellow wire that no one saw. Yeah, <laughs> right. Oh, man. Uh, so what's up? Where, where, what are you guys doing? Where you at? What's, what's fresh? Yeah, so I'm in what server? I'm in LA Kilo right now. Mm-hmm. Uh, Pace, did you say you found a dungeon? Uh, yeah. It's an Eldritch Glade, though. 
Yeah, we can do that. Where are you at? I'll just meet him wherever you're at. Uh, one second. Seven minutes on it. Two uncommon, four craft, four craftable. One no, white. Oh, I don't think we have craftable. Okay. Skip. All right, so just meet me in LA Kilo. That'll be good. Yeah, happy um, hump day. Small Space Wednesday with Crypto Stash is now live. I'm just getting That's your, right. grabbing your link here. Right. Said he's four rare, right? Uh, five rare, one epic, I think. I got. I have uh, two epics. I, I picked I up a... another epic. Oh, you got another epic? Oh, so we're at two epics? Oh, perfect. Yeah. I got a Lich King, four rare, eight tokens. Lich King, four rare, like eight tokens. How many spins? Six, which is more than usual. But we can do that, yeah. 29 to 32. It should be in range. I'm in L.A. Hotel. L.A. Hotel. Just to get something on the board here. Secret Stash, would you like to meet me in L.A. Hotel, please? All right. So we'll switch now. I just loaded into Julie real quick. It was sick. Okay, though, I got one. the link for Secret <laughs> Agent Stash. I'm going to drop that. He will be doing a small rare space giveaway on his YouTube channel. So just keep both tabs open. Make hey, sure you, nice so sir. on YouTube, it's subscribe. Subscribe equals follow, not pay on YouTube. <laughs> you know, I know a lot of people do get, they do kind of like get met, like mess up with that, I think sometimes. Okay. People are like scared to hit the, hit the button. Yeah. They're, yeah. They're like, I don't know if I hit that button, bro. I, am I paying money? Is money coming out of my account? Yeah. You Who said um, uh, LA what again? LA hot hotel. 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 That hot tell. Okay, I'm oh, in man. the area. Uh... Yeah, that should be a good one, Pace. Easy ores, no ores on the easy. Yeah, I mean, that's what oh, yeah, it, it looked, go, looked pretty. I just knew we could, we could all get in, and it was more slots than it usually is, so. Oh, show. There's Lord Misfits. And it'll be quick, hopefully. Oh, he's drinking some potions. Trying to get those double points. Yeah, I got the recipe for that potion in here somewhere. It kind of sucks the double points end before Friday. Kind of annoying. Yeah. For the prestige. It'd be good things. for weekend. Midweek mid madness, yeah. Yeah, I get you. Yeah. Oh, he just did the. He did the potions first, and then when he did the um, sprinkles, it had the potions in his hand still. All right, so I'm in Watertown. Where are you at, Stan? Oh, I'm I'm here with everybody else at the gate already. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, I think they sent a TP. Oh no, that's that's this metaverse thing. Though. I can send a TP. Um. Here we go. I rolled that last one. I don't know who wants to go, but I'm thirty. Thirty nine should be good, right? I just can't open anything. Oh, hammer time! Steps up to the bat. Let's go. I'd say maybe lockbug. Yo, best. You don't have another one of those chess pieces again, do you? By any chance? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I have to go on my meta. Do you want it right now? I mean, be nice. The fireball one? I haven't. Yeah. I have. Yeah. Hold on. How much yeah, time do I have? You got time. Six right, minutes. Six minutes. So I got I got Kevin Smart. on the stream here, and he's saying that uh, he heard that right now there's no point for new players to play big time anymore. Is that true? He says the entry fee is too high cost now or something. How do you guys feel about it's that? It's always guys, a point to play. I do, mean, do you guys feel like it's too high of a cost to even jump in and start playing? Well, play for free a free to good. play player, it's yeah. uh, free, right? That's um, what I'm saying, man. I mean, you know, I think they, I think he means maybe earning or something, but I think people get those those, those, wise, those things confused. You know, they think you have to if you're playing, you have to be earning, and if you have to be earning, then that means you got to be doing a big investment. Just sure, I can roll the so I, I think there's, for a free-to-play game, I think there's a lot of free content. Like, you really are getting a lot of content for free. Like, a lot of yeah. gameplay, a lot of grinding. You can put hundreds in this hour, hours in this game for free. Yeah, and build up on top charts. of that, you, you have the potential to maybe along the way, while you're leveling up and having fun, to get an NFT drop. Mm -hmm. I mean, Stack I played for a couple of chips. months for free Stack before I decided chips. to buy my first NFT. Yeah, Stack exactly. up on everything you need. Or later yeah I, I think but if you're looking to earn there's several different ways people do that you know by 
you know, owning rental pack. There's a lot of people who just, you know, do rentals to people. They don't even play the game or just only come in to yeah. craft hourglasses. So like, it just kind of depends on what, you know, what games you like playing. But I like, I like grinding the dungeons. Where you at, Face? Oh, yeah, you can drop it. Did it really just do that? Hold on. And, and I think that any kind of earning system, you know, you're gonna you want to have some sort of buried entry because if you don't, obviously, you're just gonna get botted. Like you oh, see some like pixels, <laughs> where it's just like crazy. Glitch botted. coming out of my um, meta. Okay. Funny. All good. You could drop it good. in the dungeon. Hey, yeah. how about that? It's a good one. Oh, yeah, I think. Yeah, it's a good one. Good stuff. Oh, I need level thirty-five to put it on. That's fine. Though. Are you I'll guys? Just... Are you guys ready? I'm Everybody good. ready to go in? Should I probably have a different one? I didn't look at hey, that. PC, PC, <laughs> PG thirteen. All right, but I'm ready. Uh, yeah, I'm ready. I'm, ready. I'm going in. I can, I can give in. it to you afterwards, Pace. I could trade you one probably. I've played months. Um, yeah, I started playing big time in August of twenty twenty two. So I've been slowly building up my collection over the period, you know of a, like a year and a half almost two years mm -hmm. and when i bought like metaverse spaces they were uh or even time wardens there was a they they were they announced these time warden mystery boxes and they came out for like eight dollars each and like no one bought them no you know, one bought, bought them like, you're right man i remember them. that I, they were on sale and, like and i remember when they released like it just they, they were like if moving. people knew what those were worth they would have bought it would the they would have been crazy and i saw them too and i was like man eh, i don't know if i really want to invest in those you know i didn't really like think through it as much and, but one when, when is because it was before the system was actually in play, the economy system. So you didn't really yeah, understand. No one knew what they were. They're like, what are yeah. these time warden things? <laughs> yeah. So, Kevin, we're jumping into these dungeons, basically. And these are uh, special prestige dungeons where you, you can actually earn more. And um, where you basically you go through and, and you fight all the, the, the monsters, find all the, the treasure, loot everything you can, and uh, kill the boss. And uh, hopefully you earn a bunch of tokens. Probably down to thirty-two. But there's yeah, like different, there's different guy. like uh, you know conditions for for when. Mine here. Work here. Uh, what are we doing? Are we waiting for somebody? So this is the ninja leap pants here. Oh, Pace, did you just fall uh, Yeah, I made a, I made a mistake. <laughs> <laughs> I got stuck on that one rock. I hate here, how they I'll, changed it. I'll come over here and revive them, and then if you guys could TPS. I, I had to change my pocket watch. I was too high level. 39 spine, right? Going no, down. this is a... Oh, well, yeah, that would be fine if you just want to, not, if you're not opening boxes. Uh, my other one's a 23. I don't we have like no stuff. quantum picture? Okay, I have to go quantum picture of some sort. Oh, yeah. No picture. Execution! Uh, Love a good execution, man. 18. Where did I put my other quantum picture? 43. Oh, there it is. 24. I'm on fire. Oh, no, all the clockies. Oh, there's too many clockies. Oh, except I'm getting the the skill glitch. I can't even call my um. I can't call my healing drones in. Uh oh. We need the drones. Release the drones. So I'm a quantum fixer, but I still don't have any healing. Sorry, guys. <laughs> um, so basically, what you're saying is you're useless. <laughs> I can throw grenades <laughs> and stuff. Yeah, I can chuck grenades though. Ooh, chuck grenades are the best of them. And there's like no way to unstick it either. Got some big time tokens on that one. Hmm. I'm 
times five. Try getting taking it off my hot bar. No, I, I think I have to go to my metaverse and back. Oh no! Would you? Oh, why can you, you break do that it? though? I don't have gates. This guy doesn't have gates yet. It just it's fine. Just run. I mean, if you can't go to your metaverse. You're gonna be beat. Just gonna have to eat it. <laughs> just gonna have to eat it. We'll have to. We'll just not die. Yeah. Don't just die. Play good. <laughs> I got tree lives. Don't I'll, throw, I'll just throw a lot of tree lives. Yeah, put those health potions on the hot fire. Rocks stink. Sixers on pace. Yeah, big game tonight. Well, hey, good to see I you, mean, Billy it's Bean. not like they, if they lose, they're out, but. Yeah, but it's definitely good so, for yeah. eating. Yes. Confidence. I'm not a huge basketball fan, but. Out of level range. No, no I can't open the tiny box. It's only 253, too. Mine's like 356 or something. Yeah, I would open it if I could. Might take a crack at it. I don't think it's gonna let me. Oh, it did. Let me. Crypto Stash, you gonna get the NFT? Alright, let's go. Let's go, come on. Probably not. I don't probably. think we have the NFT bonus. <laughs> He's though. like, probably not. <laughs> <laughs> Why you gotta kill it for me, custom? That's a that's a really that's a good chance though. I mean it's a good chance. Yeah. You miss hundred percent of the shots you don't take. Oh Hola mi amigo. Good to see you, Arrows Largos hanging out with us. That means the long rice. Like long grain rice. Thank you, thank you. Oh, you think you'd like to keep the bonus slots like this? Where at like the high levels you get like seven and an eight bonus rolls? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, in the event that said there was no, um, they didn't put an end date. They just said starting now. And they didn't say like ending, you know, soon or whatever. So who knows? Maybe it'll be starting now and indefinite until further notice. Everyone, no, no one even in my chat is even pulling for me. They're, uh, they're like, is Stash going to get the NFT? Is this going to be the day he does it? And everyone's like, nah. <laughs> It's got to be. It's going to be. We, well, we just need to go find a dungeon with the inherent bonus. Yeah. I guess. If you want an NFT, we can try to roll hard for NFTs. But you'll have to open Epoch Chess. Yeah. yeah. I know. So, oh, okay. So, Stash, right before you got on, I was in my Metaverse space, and I normally don't open the Epochs in my Metaverse space, but we had some new viewers mm -hmm. and stuff, and it was a pretty cheap one. Yeah. So I decided to open it. Mint number one epic. What? Yep, I got mint number one epic That's fire. Well. You're a beast, man. I don't know what to say. It's crazy. Yeah, but, but I like mint number ones. I'm, yeah, I'm still a believer that mint number one's more valuable than any I other mean, mint I mean, me number. too, man. I told you, we've talked about this, you know, because we both kind of come from the, the OG Wax days where that was a thing, you know? In the way back. In the way, way. The long, in the, long in ago. In the way back. Way, way back. <laughs> oh, nope. Yeah, that's, that's two mint number ones in this game for me. They're both pretty nice. Mint I have a mint number one epic and a mint number one legendary. Oh, and that was cool. Oh, no, 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 no. Get away. Oh, shit. Yeah, I'm coming for the... the re okay, you guys got it. Uh... Yeah, if you got, like, large rejuvenation potions or anything like that, 
or uh, large health potions. Good to have on the hot bar right now. Yeah, I put them on my hot bar. I just I had just used one and then I got smashed on uh, with that explosion. I, I'm so bad. All right, well we got the captain down, so he's gonna stop summoning stuff. I am the captain now. Hello, silent one. Good to see you, summit, silent one. Uh, you know, the rarity of NFTs, someone was asking in the chat about rarities of NFTs, you know, it's funny, it, it, I just have bad luck. It's not even necessarily that they're, in, that they're that rare, I just have had horrible luck trying to get NFTs, man. I've, I've had that said to me several times, so we're going to get you one. Yeah, it's usually not, not when you, somebody in detail, you tell me that, like, I can never get NFT drop. I was like, play with me tomorrow, we will get you an NFT. I mean, that's usually when somebody gets it from your group is when they kind of say they don't get them. Yeah. <laughs> well, I, I've said it so many times. Why isn't it happening? <laughs> yeah, I never just, got one either. I'll take it, one. It's, the thought's just been marinating. It's, it's coming. Trust me. It's because I believe my account is lucky. Therefore, it is lucky. Took a couple times and I got three playing with custom in the matter of like like a oh, month. Oh, I got a token from that rock. Dang, I should have waited for you guys. I was two tokens in that rock. Thanks. Got two in one day playing in customs group. I've gotten two today, I think. It's a slow Wednesday for you. An extra satellite subtree here. I believe I do have an extra satellite subtree here in my metaverse space. Those aren't typically too hard to find. Not like the freaking Gates subtree. Gates is so hard to find. The guy's up on the freaking rock. How do you even get up there? I think he just spawned up there. <laughs> I'm like Hey go up. Yep. Alright guys. Grab some grab some mana's backs. Yeah. Make sure you've got as up. much mana as possible. That's a great all these guys. Uh, let's see, guys. Devastation no, just took them all apart. Yeah, de the Devastator. Yeah, the Devastation subtree, I think, is better than Lord of the Dead now. For sure. Like I said before, by the time I activate Lord of the Dead, Custom already shot shrooping fans through everybody <laughs> yeah. i'm like okay well on to the next fight everybody got some tokens there it looks like yeah let's go all right here come stand next to the rock i got tokens already Yep. So everybody gets a chance. Anybody that's standing around the rock gets a chance. See, look, they got drops. Yeah, got got a couple right there. That's that's boss over there. Come back this way. Oh, boss. Okay. Yeah, I went the wrong way. Go clear. It's probably just a little dead end too, but you never know. Maybe it'll open up to like that giant area, and we get tons of more stuff to kill. Yeah, satellite subtree is really good. I think that's gotten a little bit of a buff. Everyone's doing pretty good for Cyber Pirates No Healer. <laughs> I got a decoy in there, and I think Pace got a trap. Mm. 
Nice. Yeah, you're getting up there though, Crypto Stash. You're ranked 27 at level 30. I think you unlock um, the tier four pocket watches too. Mm -hmm. Getting closer. Getting closer to that ultimate weapon. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. That's what I need. I'm looking for a really good Chronomancer right now. So I've got a couple of Shadow Blades. Mm -hmm. Although I would like a really good another really good Shadow Blade to start over. So I have no healing. Let me see if I can change my pocket watch. To another healer. Let's see if my healing drones come back. Oh. oh, they're still glitched out on this guy too. Well, I might as well. I'll just I'll just keep on him because he's I can still instant revive. And I got decoys. It's still useful to the team. Oh, they're back. There we go. Got my healing drone back. Nice. They're fixed. Switching the watches worked. Gonna mine this rock. Oh, yeah. Nope, not nothing in that one. It was a dud. Dud. That one was a dud. I should take those ninja pants off the Time Warrior I just have and put it on this Quantum Fixer. I'm going to use this Quantum Fixer a lot more, I feel. All right, good luck in the boss fight. Let's go. Oh, we're missing one person. Oh, they're coming. Ape Bonjin. Hammer time. Up, All right. Hammer time. It's very, very nice to meet you guys. I like that guy's the screen name. Hammer time is cool. It's funny. It's showtime. That was like a fountain of bugs right there. <laughs> Got all these explorers on your weapon throw. I think it'd be pretty cool if like there was like um like an ant hill kind of thing and like the bugs kept coming out of it. This yeah, swarm out of it, that's kinda cool. cool. Like you had to like kill it, like you know, blow up the ant hill. Close the portal or entrance. Yeah, just let us know if you guys want an access code to play big time. We've got plenty of codes to share. Oh, yeah, yeah. If you have any questions, these guys can hit really hard too. Good luck. All right, good luck on the box. Let's go. Give me all the stuff. Nothing. A legendary conversion. What is conversion? Oh, conversion. You convert health to mana, I think. It's like, that's a weird... I haven't seen that skill in a long time. Found an exalted T4 watch for some reason. Oh, an exalted? That's not bad. That's no, not I'm not, bad. not looking for it. I'd rather have a T5 or 6, but I can keep it. Yeah, it's not... You know, yeah, either save it for a body or it's a good, like, just like, or, hey, you know, I, you know... I got one at level 20, you know, just get them up to level 20 just in case, you know. Yeah, or possibly, like you said, for your community. I'm not mad at doing that. Ooh, it's a tier four exist exalted quantum fixer. Yeah, Maybe it'll have some, if it comes with like gates on it or something, you should definitely run it. I'll decrypt it and see. Ended up with 15 tokens. I'm not bringing up the rear. Let's go. Oh, I didn't even check how many I got. I forgot to even check. I just was looking at the pocket watches. You got 31. 
You said I got 31? Yes. Nice. That's not bad. That's pretty quick. Not bad at all. It was only 17 minutes. Turn. All right. Am I hyped for Alluvium's new beta, the closed beta? It looks pretty cool. I don't know if you guys have checked out Alluvium here, but they're doing a new like beta, closed beta round with the op their overworld type of game stuff. So. Alluvium, huh? Should be interesting, yeah. I haven't played Alluvium in quite some time. But I should recheck it out. Yeah, it's fun. Uh, I mean, like like I said, with their their new like update, I think they're gonna make some pretty big changes, some big big shifts with the overworld. Yeah, it was a beautiful looking world, like open world, you know. Yeah, well, and they they just don't really have they just didn't really ever have anything in it, <laughs> you know. Like it yeah. was just it was just very barren. So it was like, well, no, I'm yeah, rooting Mr. for Best. him. What? You said, you said you had a uh, lower one of those chest Pro pieces. I probably do. What 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 level are you? I'm 32 now, so I mean it'll only Seeing take me three more levels. But if you have a 30. 30 one, I'll take that. Yeah, I'm gonna go decryptus in Watertown. I'll look in a second. I'll give you this one back. Yeah. I just I just want the fireball. I don't really care about the one stats. Brown. Stats. Don't think everyone's gonna have two orange. What's flash for um, quantum? It's kind of like a stun. And it's um, wisdom you're looking for. Yeah, yeah there's cheap uh, cheap town portals here. And I meant in portals. 2,000. Here's I mean, a, this a doesn't have another energy confluence. This watch isn't great. No. Has twenty five wisdom on it for uh, twenty five wisdom for a quantum, but has one hundred twenty one strength, one hundred twenty seven uh, intelligence, one sixteen agility, and no uh, good so like a, a warrior style quantum. It'd be yeah, a good melee, it'd be a good a good melee master. Dual blade and one one hand sword expertise, but nothing else. I mean, it's something that I can give you to give to one of your viewers, but I'm not going to use it in your metaverse until someone yeah. asks. Star King, nice to meet you, buddy. Thanks for coming down and chilling tonight. Do you guys just want to try another ener ener another energy confluence? It's got six rolls and it's a level thirty-two or seven rolls. Uh, I'm down. I'm down. I don't know. It's one of the it's one of those crit those uh, obstacle course ones, right? No. It, I think okay. it's the floating outer space one. Or that's what I meant. But, you know, those are pretty maps. They're very cool. It's cool. To, that's I think they're great maps. And there's been a lot of changes to all the dungeons, you know, with all the different roles and stuff we can get. Yeah. We can see. Is I it mean, the one with, absolute, with the... Absolute, absolute garbage, we can always town teleport. Is it the one with um, the crazy... I can't remember. Bottom, right? I think this is the disappearing staircase one. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. But we got speed bonus, health up, and it doesn't have very bad curses, and it's got seven rolls, so. Yeah, I got a good one for you, Pace. 100 125 plus health. 92 energy. All right. Um, I'm ready yeah. for this map to be good again. I just don't want to count any map out right now because they just changed everything. You know, they adjusted the – I'm pretty sure they adjusted the dungeons when they did the roll change. Hey, thank you for the lurp, Roman. I appreciate it. Muchos gracias. Are you ready, Crypto? Yeah, I'm ready. Um, I think I can. Yeah, so I'm still on cooldown. Yeah. Trade you, buddy. Yeah, I'll give you that other one back. You guys are still here, right? In the same. Yep. Yeah, yeah. I just sent you a portal. Oh, shit. I thought you did. Thank you, sir. 
All right. Yes, sir. All right, all right, all right. Ooh, I don't think I have three cosmetics, actually. Oh, three. Oh, dang it. It's craftable. Sorry. I mean, uh, cra craftables, yeah. It's kind of expensive, too. Nine, huh? Sorry, well, we'll keep looking. Nine big time. Yeah. Um, I was excited to try a seven row low level dungeon. I'm like, I can't get my inventory, man. I'm bugged right now. You should be able to go to your uh, metaverse and back. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to Go to metaverse and hit cancel. Oh, and it'd be 40. Does everybody have a craft? Does dungeon. everybody have a craftable special? Whoop. Whoops, sorry about that. Let me mute the dog. Uh, Crypto uh, stash, the dog. do you have a craftable special? There we go. Sorry, I forgot to mute the doggo. No, I don't. No? no Are you not, sure? Not special, no. Corona so spatial rip. Oh, I think it's too legendary. Yeah, I'll, I, I, only have, was... I only have one craftable right now. So. That was like a seven or eight roll on that one, too. Yeah, this was a seven roll dreadlords. Oh, where's that at? I mean, but you need a craftable special. Oh, are, okay. you sure? are you sure you don't have that? I yeah. Some kind of... hey, what are the epics that you ran it? Because they might be specials. Yeah. But you said it has to be craft a craftable like? special, right? Yeah, but what yeah, epics it did you run? Oh, uh, so I have. Um... A Warhammer to to Lance a lot. Hold on, my dog's got upset Tommy and he's begging, so I think he might have to go outside real quick. And then battle, what was it? Oh, uh, the Warhammer of Lancelot yeah. and then uh, Battle Axe of Sir Palamides. Uh, yeah, that's what it says. So those, no, neither one of those are. Alright. So let me get that. But these exist. I didn't see. Uh, your, I... What about your. Do you have a rare shield or no? Uh, yeah. They're. I think they're craftable specials. Uh, oh yeah, that's not, craft, that's not craftable. That's what I'm saying. Not a craftable shield though. Oh okay, never mind. Yeah, I only have one craftable. All right, find some. Kevin yeah, no, said he uh, just no, downloaded no, big time. Good man, I got the the. Yeah, I've used my access code above. That's great, man. I appreciate it. All I know is those more roles exist in No Man, but I didn't think they did. All right, so what server are we Yeah, like everything, six and seven here. Got an oasis here. <coughs> is the dunes map? Oh, never mind, you need Stepwalker. Right. We're, still, we're still looking, right? We're still looking? Yep. All right, let me go to another place here. We'll go to India. Server lag has not been so bad today. I haven't had any issues with server lag today. I mean, not that I haven't in the past, but. No. You know, the thing with with just getting started on big time too as a new player, like the tutorial and like in introduction of the game is fairly long. How do you guys feel about the intro for the game? Being, I mean, it's not crazy long, okay. but it's fairly. I'm long. back. Sorry about that. I mean, here's another Lich King, but it's eleven tokens. It's pretty crazy. All right, thank you for your patience, everybody. And their health is up four, but our health's up one in seven rolls. a lot of tokens of this is um five roll dreadlords nine tokens everyone can get in what are the curses easy curses i don't know you guys want to do a uh, five roll dreadlords la julie i'm in for whatever la julie So what's one of the new favorite games that you've been playing lately, Stash? Um, Dude, to be perfectly honest, I started playing Fallout 4 again for a little bit here. <laughs> oh, nice. 
you know, I've, I've been Jones and playing Fallout. So I, I just finished watching the it on Amazon. Yeah, 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 for sure. That's one of those things where it's like, oh, man, I've been, you know, you, you get that nostalgia and you're like, oh, I'm going to go put, back and play a little bit, you know? And someone, one, one of my one of my agents in chat asked me why I didn't go do New Vegas. And I was like, yeah, it was kind of a toss-up between New Vegas and, and 4. But a huge, huge uh, Fallout fan, man. That show was awesome. Yeah, the only thing bad about it is there's only eight, eight episodes and I have to wait until the, the sequel know, comes out right. for the next season. Never played it. Do you have to have played it to really understand the show? No. Nope. First person shooter. No, the show is good. I, I mean, like, yeah, if you if you played the show, I mean, if you played the game, then, like, it, it, it really is uh, cool, but. Yeah, because you know, like, the backstory on, like, vaults and stuff, like, you know, that they're not just, like, happy places a lot of times and. I have to check it out. I've been watching that gentleman show then time. It's really good. You should check it out. And uh LA Julie Perfect. There's everybody. Okay, I was starting to roll that last one, so I'll go ahead and finish my roll. Let's go with Twisted Garden. Uh put a one or two more in there. And pass. Uh, might have Ooh, to nice. <laughs> I'll roll again. Oh, there you go. There you All go. All right. Chance for schematic, too. Everybody ready? Yeah. Loading it up. Lock and load. What time is it here? It is about 7.45 p.m. Eastern Standard Zone time. No, you're supposed to say it's big time. It's big time. What time is it there? It's big time. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. That was like a missed opportunity. I had, I had to jump on that. I had to jump on it. It's big time. Oh, yeah. man. You Team TNT that? says you know he didn't know. Didn't know that there was a show for Fallout. That's crazy. It's hammer time, of course. It's hammer time. I like that, dude. Really. No, yeah, the the Fallout show on on it's on Amazon Prime. It's really it is. good, it's man. It's on Prime, yep. It's really good, but yeah, I mean, me being a huge fan, obviously, I loved it. I I would love to hear the thoughts from someone who's never played the video game before. Like that'd be kind of cool to hear what the, what they think about it. Honestly, I think the set design, design is awesome. They just did like you know like the post apocalyptic you know like nineteen fifties oh, yeah. style. Yeah, that's I I I've I've always loved the yeah that that retro 1950s 40s style that you know that is accustomed to Fallout right. I love I love their televisions. Yeah, they've got uh, a lot of really good unique things that they've. Okay, made I iconic. still got time on all of my hourglasses. Make sure you do it. An hourglass oh, check. Thank this you, is sir. A 28 yes. Twenty-eight to thirty-three dungeon. Twenty-eight to thirty-three. I think I'm staying on this guy. I'll stay on the fixer. There we go. All right, that chair off the hot bar, though. I don't need a chair. Where's Pace at? Uh, Bastion's. No! You, Bastion. Pace is setting the pace, dude. He does. He's fast. I know. I just, I, I don't know the, if it's like we something. Saw the Bastions are right here. Kind of helps. Yeah, I am fast though. <laughs> and boom, baby. I'm even faster than custom, basically, and he's got more dex and agility, probably. Well, not on this guy. This is, this is a quantum fixer. Oh, uh, well, even on your shadow blade, but still. Well, dex that's is hands, agility is speed. Is feet. Yeah, yeah. But it's because I, 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 I don't really have high dash. agility. I have. Max dash with the max evasion and whatever, and then I use the double tap dodge thing, my mouse. So even when I'm not dashing, I'm boosting forward. Preston, did you put that in there again? No, my decoy's outside the box. This should be pretty easy though. So let me put He's one out of the way. I got another decoy ready. Oh no. 
to try to leave those ones that are way out there so we can uh, maybe not make them spawn again. Uh -oh. Poor decoy. That poor decoy got murdered. Did a good job though. Here, take another decoy. A lot of pirates. Yeah, they're coming in thick. <laughs> yeah, they are. Oh, that hurt. Gotta kill the summoner right here. Quartermaster. We're running out of mana. Man, that's a lot of them stunned down there. Oh, now they're mad at me. <laughs> now they're chasing me. No. Boom, baby. Alright. So I got another decoy ready. Now they switched to bugs. Yeah. Oh, there's pirates. And more pirate. And more pirate. At least they don't have freaking laser beams. Is the sound really low? I I don't I don't think the sound is low in the in the chat. It might just be you, Abazar. We're cranking. Hey, good evening. What's up, Josh? Good to see you, bud. We'll have to go play some metalcore again. I think I still have one more metal core to give out, so I do want to do a metal core night and uh, give out another access code. Oh, nice. You're dying. Rank 22? Like, global rank 22? Yeah, but that's a pretty fun game. I heard they did a, bu a bunch more balancing issues and stuff like that. But I think I want to at least collect my marks, right? Like, get some daily daily quests done, get my marks, just in case that game becomes fun. It, it, the game, I've played quite a bit of Metalcore, like, through the different iterations. And what I will say is that I feel like um, the game has a lot of really great elements. I feel like I just haven't found the best way to put them together. Oh, wow, you're at, like, 43,000 marks? That'll be a nice airdrop. Yeah, I think I'm at like 2,500 marks. Wow, look at all these. It's got the summoner in there. Oh, nope. level yep. up, let's go! Level 28. Nice. I owe it all to you, Custom. It's you. I, I want to thank Custom for my level 28. Without him, this could not be possible. I also want to thank my family <laughs> for supporting me playing video games for a living. Or just never saying anything to me and always talking behind my back, at least. <laughs> I'd like to thank the, the Big Time Academy for always supporting my streams. <laughs> they like me. They really, really like me. Go, go, decoy. I want the decoy to be dressed the same as me, though. That would be kind of cool. That the, would make it sense, yeah. It should wear the same NFT. That would be cool. Am I asking too much? No. Uh, probably, Have but... money ears on my decoy? <laughs> You're probably asking too much. Yes, don't spawn. Uh, they're about to. You know it. Just don't kill that last floating guy. 
He might be blocking the spawn. Yeah, he's like just chilling out there. Oh, dang it. No, 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 here they go, the bugs. About to knock him across the screen now. Bang, get out of here. Before I put a decoy down. Oh, there they go. Go after the dang decoy, guys. Wow. I know he's not dressed like me, but go after him. Oh, there's a whole bunch of pirates. They murdered that decoy. Oh, on the new decoy. As long as they stay out of the circle. Yeah. We're so close. We're so close. We got it. We got it. There we go. Oh my gosh, one more Bastion. I thought that was our third. So, uh, Tasty Gamer Boy is asking, what is my favorite game that I feel has the most is the most fun to play, and then what is the best earner? Well, I, I would say that I think Big Time is probably one of the best earners. You know, you're never going to say, like, if earner only means, like, well, which one has no investment, <laughs> and then you can earn lots of money, like, I feel like that's a weird, you know, benchmark, but that's how a lot of people do look at things. Oh, Ooh, no, I got exploded. How were the drops? Uh, we had a couple of really good dungeons. Um, I think the the desert map did really good today. We had a good Jotunheim. We had... Um, Oh, we had a couple pretty good dungeons. This is our first meadow map of the evening. And I feel like, I mean, we've been stuck on these um, bastions, so that bastions don't really drop tokens. Yeah, they suck. But yeah, then we'll be able to clear the map, and we should be able to see. Is there a summoner or something somewhere? Yeah, there's a captain right there. There we go. Probably not the only one who needs mana. These healing drones just take so much mana. Woo. You had a bunch stunned over there. Nope. Oh, here they come. So some saying, drones. Yeah, so saying, like, what's the most fun Web 3 game is, like, kind of hard because, like, I actually have fun playing quite a few different games, man. It, but everyone is a little bit different, you know? So, like, ye yesterday, uh, I will tell you guys, like, I played X-Verse, which I thought was actually fa fairly fun. It's a fairly straightforward shooter, but... Uh, fun and then I played right after that I played captain and company, which is so incredibly different I mean the difference is night and day and I had a ton of fun playing that So it really comes down to you know, what kind of games you like because there's a fun I can you know There's a fun game for that genre in, in web 3, you know Yeah, I did a little bit of captain company. I still need to actually get a game I just kind of like had enough time to explore the island, but it looked fun looked interesting interesting art style Yeah, I got a couple I mean, it, buddies that love Captain Company. It's just it's, it's basic, man. It's a super basic game, but the game loop is fun, and you can earn. And they're doing a big event right now with with Blast, so you know Blast has been one of those uh, one of those currencies that you know has been kind of hot right now. So boom, baby. Get away from my decoy. There we go. Let's get it. 
Two. We got four tokens from the quest. Two tokens. Ah, ah, ah. Yeah, it's been not the best so far. So let's see now. <laughs> I know, right? This has been... Now that we got them out of the way. Yeah, now, now we can go kill stuff. We actually get repaid for it. Yeah, there's a lot of teams that when they get the Bastions, they will just skip them and just clear the whole map and then just teleport out. Like, they won't, you know, do 15 minutes of Bastions. <laughs> Ooh, a level up. Level up. I think I'm going to increase the level of my grenades a little bit. A little bit more intelligence on this guy, so he's got more mana and um, easier to equip armors. we go two tokens coming in let's go still super crazy that i got a mint number one. Oh, uh vx per i got a mint number one epic fireplace from a box so i would say drops are are good today i got a, a mint number one drops have have pretty much the best i've had for a while i don't get tokens Oh. Oops, exploders. Yeah, we need to make sure we find those exploders. Yeah. I think that was a summoned one, but they, I think the robot exploders have been dropping the best, better than the bug exploders. I didn't want to leave those guys alive. They could have been holding all the tokens. <laughs> so yeah, there's a lot of fun games out there. I mean, I think Big Time is one of those ones that I do actually really enjoy playing. Uh, you know, it's great to do it regularly every week and have crew and people hanging out and doing it. Um, you know, My Pet Hooligan is a fun one that I play a lot. Uh, someone in chat was asking about Decimated. Uh, you know, Decimated is still in really early stages of development. That's why you don't hear anybody talking about it that much. But they have a really great base for a game, too, man. And uh, they're going to be fire here in the next six months. Because they've been building out a lot of really good stuff. They just need to have content, right? So it's the same problem that you see with Big Time. Where it's just, it needs missions. It needs quests. It needs, you know, incentivization to go do things. And right now, you know, Big Time has that in the form of, you know, monetary, right? Oh, you can earn at least. But there's a lot of things lacking from an MMO, right? An RPG of this nature. So same thing with um, <coughs> with uh, Decimated, I think. It, it's it's really, they, they got some great stuff going so far, though. Which way pace going? All right, pace going that way. <laughs> Follow the pace guy. Yeah, it's like Desolation's a lot of fun, too, but it's just, you know, so early that there's no not enough content. Like, there's, like, one map or two maps. Yeah. But I think Desolation could end up being fun. I think so. I haven't tried Definitely it yet. Definitely a, a different style game, you know? I haven't tried it yet. Oh, really? You haven't checked, it, checked out the Desolation? No, I'll have to go check it out. Yeah, it's kind of like a really high up over the shoulder, and, um... Like almost like a contra kind of thing. Like you, like you're like you know your guy runs around and like like stuff runs at you. You got to kind of like dodge and avoid them and use skills. Little boss fights, really tough boss fights. Raptors and uh, World Shards is doing their airdrop too. So I think World Shards has some. Um, like quests to do uh just like basically follow them on twitch follow them or not twitch but like you know twitter the other the other twits yeah. and um you can get some pretty good airdrops from world shards that's cool i want to get a, a game of boss fighter going uh where i do the vr and then have everyone else kind of come in and try and smash I smash on all the agents that's yeah really and um boss fighters is going through some pretty big updates right now too so they're going to have um, dedicated servers now. So no more like um, trying to join someone across the world and getting disconnected. They'll all have dedicated servers. They have a new map. The boss fighters tokens coming out. They're going to have like crafting 
uh, and they're going to have PC bosses. So you don't have to only have a VR headset. PC players will be able to yeah. be a boss too. That's cool. I, I like the VR thing. I think that's a, that, I think that's a really good angle and like use for VR. Is like is like you always think about like well how do you incorporate something like this into into the game? You know, Left uh, like like uh, effectively the VR v, doing VR effectively is not easy, right? And then being able to incorporate it into a, a, a game with you know non VR players. I think they, they had a really great idea there with like, oh, well, you, the VR is the boss, which totally makes sense. Like uh, this big old... I just think there's just not enough VR players to sustain the game, so... Well, and that's what I'm saying. That that, it, that becomes a problem, right? Because there's just not enough people that will be doing VR. But uh, PC, I think the VR bosses will definitely have an advantage because I can't imagine all the buttons I'd have to push to do what some of those guys do. Yeah. We got a doggo tree time. Left house. Having a big time with big time. Loving it. Miss it. Can't wait to jump back in. Well, you, you're welcome to play with us. I'll be doing like normal dungeons and helping people level up this weekend. But here, we got that doggo tree time. So let me get the doggo cam a little bit bigger. We'll go run out there. He's getting old. I'm not going to make him come in here. <laughs> He's getting old. I'm not making him come. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm not going to make him get off his couch. I'm going to go over there and give him a treat. Reign of Terror NFT being removed from open loot. I don't know what happened with that. Do you know anything about that, uh, Custom? Do you know anything about the Reign of Terror NFTs being removed? Because I know that was one of the games that they were kind of incubating that was going to be on their platform, but... And I've talked to the Reign of Terror team from a long time ago, man. Alright, thank you. Thank you for the doggo tree time. My team's like, we need a healer. Where'd our healer go? Alright, I'm back. Yeah, thank you. It's great to see you, Left House. And Crypto Arts. Left House Crypto Arts. Made a feature-length movie on the Wax blockchain. It was really cool. All right. Bombs away. The frozen pirate bruiser. It's running away. It is running <laughs> Get back away. here. <laughs> You're not going to escape. We go some more tokens coming in. Yeah, the devastation's working really good. It just melted that purple and blue shield. Yeah. Hey, a token in the box. I'll take it. What's in the box? Uh oh, I'm starting to starting to run in place uh oh yep oh no, no. Yeah. We're, we're <laughs> oh yeah the Clears tokens just are just like, floating in the air they are They're just... i was trying to throw my shuriken fan i couldn't it's not, it's it's not working hopefully it's just bugging out for a second i'm gonna get us though yeah, but James, what happened with Reign of Terror and why they're not supporting anymore? I didn't see anything about that. That's a pretty big news, man. Hey, Alpha Heads. That's crazy. I think we crashed here. I think we might have crashed. <laughs> yeah. This is probably going to be my last one anyway. I'm going to go watch the rest of this game. Anybody wants to hop in? Let's see. We crash. Just checking crash. the announcements. Yeah, I just got kicked. Yeah. 9,900 milliseconds on LA. Uh, I think LA crashed. But sometimes it'll put you back in the. Uh, 411. No. I mean, I'll put me at right. no man's. Yeah. Okay, no, there's no updates in the big time Discord. Oof. 
Wah, wah. I'm gonna take a break. All right, guys, I'm gonna so change servers. If you have anybody that wants to hop in? Yeah, I'm gonna I take. Really would join us. I think Jilly Bean was waiting. I'm gonna take a break too and watch this game. Philly all guys, right, all right. Here. Philly guys over here taking a break. The wrong yeah. game. You guys are in the wrong game. <laughs> I mean, you're in the right game right now, is what I mean. No I'm gonna go to Watertown in L.A. Foxtrot, and we need two people. All right. Two prestige players. Come on down. Lord Misfit said he'll jump in. I know he's prestige. Lord ready. Misfits, come on down. Yeah. And Rayleigh's gonna join us too, my wife. Come on down. So I'm kicking Mr. Best, and I'm kicking I Pace. Oof. The kick. The kick. The kick. Yep. They'll kick with love. You only get kicked if I like you. I don't kick random people. We'll just make a new team. Because someone's never... feelings always get hurt. <laughs> like, you can try to explain, like, hey, buddy, like, uh, I got to pick up a friend. They're like, what? I'm not your friend? <laughs> you know? Huh. Why can't we be friends? And Mordots, it's 2 a.m. All right. So Mordots got to take a break. Uh, looks like Rico Swabby or Pinball's here. Yeah, Who was Rico, here first? Oh yeah, Rico Swabby also is down. And we need, uh, we need Rayleigh as well. So Mordots is going to take a break. So I think we do have room for Pinball and Riley. Is Rico Swabby in chat too? He's in my chat. Oh, he's in your chat. Okay. Yeah. All right, Pinball, we'll grab you next. It's Crypto Stash turn to get people in. Let's go. And hey, you know what? I was going to do, uh, like, we're, we, we got that Rare Space NFT, that Rare Space NFT, $100 value NFT we're going to give away today here, probably after the next dungeon or so. So stick around, guys. Uh, you do need to it's be present. You got to be step. here. You hear the it's wind. great playing with your stash and everybody. Yeah, Talk yeah. You guys later. Same, man. Yeah, enjoy, enjoy the game. game. Yeah, I'll catch you tomorrow, Mr. Best. Um, I'll be on later. Maybe it'll still be on. All right, later. Yeah, and so if you're in my chat, what he's talking about, that's Secret Agent Crypto Stash. This is his YouTube. He's live on YouTube right now, and he'll be doing a small, rare space giveaway tonight. Let's go. So make sure you double-tab that open. Right. And make sure you're listening for the secret word. Yep, top top secret word coming probably after this dungeon. Would love if you guys subscribe to me on YouTube if you guys are joining the channel for the first time and you're brand new. Subscribe is just like a is just like a like on Twitter, you know. I mean on Twitch. So you just uh, you just follow on the channel. Appreciate that if you guys are hanging out. Oh yeah. My followers and viewers don't miss out on an epic opportunity. Four epics. Jeez. Yeah, that's crazy. So open loot basically is is stopping support for Reign of Terror. I don't know what happened there, but they're like, you need to get your NFTs off of the open loot platform as soon as possible. But James is saying that the, the Open Loot has a 50 USD withdrawal fee for NFTs like that, which is, I didn't know that it was 50 oh, NFTs. Oh, wow. 50 USD for that. That's crazy. Yeah, I, I've seen Reign of Terra in the marketplace for a long time. I just haven't seen yeah. like any like any development from them, really. Yeah. They've been around for a while, as I'm saying. Like, it's, it's crazy to see them... Um, you know, still not have anything out, <laughs> honestly, man. Because I've been talking with I've talked with that team before, before they, we were even with Open Loop. I talked to that Reign of Terror team. So, Reign of Terror. Yeah, it's been, probably it, just better it, for them to go independent and do their own token stuff, and yeah, you know, Open Loop might, you know, like because it's open. From what I understand, Open Loop is like a developer tool set and yeah. like marketplace for game developers, but it, you know, they don't own like Reign of Terror. No, 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 yeah, want, no, like, exactly. Market, it, you know, like, like fees, right? For like operating, like, like if someone spends like a hundred terror tokens, then they will, like open loot wants five, you know? Yeah. No, and, and I think, yeah, I think that maybe it's just a case of they, they're just kind of slow rugging, right? Uh, Agent Slander over here says that they've been AFK in their Discord for ages. 
So it just oh, really? it may be one of those projects where it's just like the team is rugged. They sold a bunch of NFTs. They rugged everybody, and uh, you know now they're kicking them from open loot finally. Yeah, I wouldn't expect to have being rugged from an open loot game, but it's not impossible. Well, once again, it's not it's not really a game from like the play big time team or open loot themselves. Yeah. You know? I never got a Reign of Terror NFT, so. Yeah, me neither. All right, let's see if we can find something even better. Chrono Spatial Rift Nexus. We might be able to switch to take a look in like the uh, lower level. Um, Icy Castle, or uh, the Icy Wastelands. We might be able to look for the lower, the mid-level dungeons over there. You're 28 now. Yeah. What server are so you guys in? I'm just random, no random server oh, looking just, for stuff. Okay. Did we get? A, did we get a full party back again? We do. Yep. Okay. I'll go switch servers real quick too. Everything I'm finding wants a whole bunch of epics. Yeah, I went and grabbed another epic on the store that I could use. I ended up so getting an epic it. emote. Oh, did you? That's cool. Yeah, uh, from a drop. You're a lucky man, sir. I probably just need to play like a, a shit ton more big time is what it comes down to. Yeah, clean, open loot, clean in house, good to, removing bad actors instead of like, you know, tarnishing the um, open loot reputation. Yeah, and that makes sense. I mean, because I, like I said, I, I also have not heard anything from Reign of Terror for a long time. So it could be that they are slow rugging. Uh, the, James here in chat is saying that like he bought 100 of their boxes, some guy bought 900 boxes. Like, oh, wow. That's a lot of money lost, man. That sucks. That's a lot of money lost. I'm sorry that happened to you, James. And, and you know, this is one of those things that we see happen uh, quite often. You know, in, in crypto in general. But it, it happens just, it happens in gaming, right? Like, games will just say, I'm sorry, we're done. And, you know, in, in regular gaming, right? And, you know, like your like, they'll just say that and then no one says, oh, you owe us. You know? Which is kind of crazy, right? But in crypto gaming, people feel like, hey, you sold things. You owe us. Like, we, we put this money into this thinking that they, you know, and a lot of times probably thinking that they're going to get some sort of return on their investment. And then they don't. And so, you know, it's one of those things where it's like, man, you know, that investment's gone. So you're not hey, it back. you know, monkey. Good to see you, buddy. All right. So we're in LA Golf. I think we found a, you said LA Golf, right? Over oh, LA Golf, I thought so. Oh, I didn't. I didn't say anything. I think Rico. Yep, oh, yes, LA Golf. Yes, okay. Oh, I don't think everyone's gonna have Leprechaun though. Oh no, I don't have Leprechaun. So close. So close. I don't. I, well, actually, I disagree, man. I think people do buy a hundred copies of things in Web Two games, for sure. Look at Counter Strike is a great example of that, where people are buying I bought tons so of much boxes. stuff in Mass Effect Three. Yeah, there's there's tons of games where people are spending <laughs> thousands of dollars for sure on in game on in game items. So, I'm I'm like I'm like sad to admit it, but I have a level ten Black Widow in Mass Effect Three. If anybody knows how how much that would cost to get unlocked, is ridiculous. I'm switch servers again. Because they basically had like little like, you know, boxes you could open and you paid like three or four dollars a time, you know. And it's great to see you, I know. Yeah, 
Yeah, I still got a legendary space for um, world shards. So if that game ever takes off, starts doing something, I might have to start grinding it. Uh, well, what I, I would also disagree with that, man. I've definitely like kickstarted some games back in the day, not even back in the day, just like in the last five year, five or six years, that uh, never made it. Like, so when you say like it, Web Two doesn't have games where they rug after a week of existing, I mean, I think that's true. And Reign of Terror has been around for a long time. They've not just been, they've not existed just for weeks. So like they've been building for a long time. Everybody have three early access. Oh man, there's only a minute and a half on this. We don't have time. Oof. I, I played um, a couple of games. There was like a Fable game that came out that was really cool. And um, they they took that. They stopped development in the alpha. Yeah. And so people may have supported. They may have bought early access assets or whatever, you know, packages or whatever it may be. Uh, but, you know, th th those people are out of luck, too. I think you, you take the same risk if you just buy a random altcoin, too. You're like, I hope this altcoin goes up, <laughs> yeah. you know? Or even, least... big or, uh, even Bitcoin, it's a little risky sometimes, but... Well, yeah, all these things are risky when, when you're talking about there's a, a financial aspect, you know, connected to it. But before, you look at, like, when you're spending a bunch of money on, like, a Mass Effect, you never had a chance to, like, possibly get that investment back, right? To say, hey, I spent $200 for the skin... You know, it could end up being a good investment where I can then sell this skin for three hundred dollars, right? It, it was just never anything you could do. So you, any money you put in, it was already rugged. You're already going to zero with that. With that, it's not an investment, right? It's just you paying the game to temporarily use something. Do you remember Waxius Racers? No. I don't remember that. Does everyone have um, three rare, three preseason, and one origin? I think I might. Where are you at? This is um, L.A. Charlie. L.A. Charlie. Let me see where it is. I think I do have those. It's four tokens and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven rolls. And we've got damage up, health up. I mean, this, this will be a pretty good one for us, I think. Yeah, L.A. Charles. Charlie. And hello, Pushy. We do have codes. And if you're watching over with uh, Mr. Crypto Stash, he also has some invite codes as well on YouTube. And all you got to do is click that link. It takes you to the Open Loop Marketplace. Then you just create your account with an email and a password. Come back while you're downloading the game and hit my little ambassador link there. Help me help you. All right, there's Hammer. There's invite. I'll risk it for the biscuit. I'll step up to the plate. Ah, uh, dude, I don't have three preseasons, dude. I thought it was three. Oh, you don't? No, I thought it was, I thought you. Meant, I'm sorry, it was the other way around. I thought you said you, three. You don't have like three. emotes? No, I don't think so, dude. Let me see. I have zero emotes. Yeah, I think emotes and titles. Oh, those are emotes are early access. Oh, that's early access. Uh, I guess preseason would be all the craftable crap. Okay. Yep, I only I only have one craftable, so that's why I only have one. It's all good. We'll find another one. All right. Emotes in the marketplace for three bucks, but are are they the preseason ones? Yeah, the preseason's all the craftable stuff. It's all the craftable stuff. Yeah. Mantle of the Onyx Throne. I think there's, I think there's some preseason titles. Yeah, there's preseason titles. There's no. Oh yeah, there is. There's a pre. Let's see what preseason titles they got. Let's go. Uh, 
All right, I'm gonna grab a title. Let's see if I can get rid of these real quick here. Hey, thank you, thank you. Epic saxophone guy. Oh my gosh, that bangs, that slaps. All right. Sorry about that. I couldn't hear anything that anybody said for the last two minutes. I was getting um, epic saxophone guy. Oh, it says extra slots till tomorrow. Dang. Can't I just have extra slots till forever? Can't I just have extra slots till forever? Fragmented realm. Let me go check outpost. Hmm, that's 35. Now we probably still need to stay around no man's land. All right, I'll check a different server. Are you streaming tomorrow too, Mr. Stash? Uh, yep. Same bat time, same stash channel. <laughs> what do you um? What do you got planned for tomorrow? Uh, so tomorrow is Top Secret Thursday, where we jump into brand new games. So I'm always playing games that I've like are brand new or have new updates or I've never played before, right? So jumping into some of those and um, yeah, uh, we got a couple a couple games on deck for tomorrow. Usually we do three games, two, three, two to three games. Five mythic to get into this freaking dungeon, jeez. Hold on, let me go craft. How come how come I can't equip my my bunny um Easter basket as a, a shield? <laughs> That'd be sweet. Dreadlords, two rare, two teal. I doubt everyone's got two teal. That's kind of a hard one. I think it's a legendary title is teal. Three rare. I got a three rare here with another energy confluence. Could be a crazy one. I don't know. You guys want to try it? L.A. Julie? L.A. Julie? Okay. Six rolls. Everybody can get into this. Let me make sure it's not preseason. Nope. Just three rare. Okay. All right. Yep. L.A. Julie. Here, I'll, I'll get the thing started. I only rolled once last time, so I'll, I'll, I'll spin a couple more times. So I think we're looking for the normal bug bonus and, or the four hit. Oh, there's the bug. It's boss bonus. Hmm. Pretty you know, boss bonus, bug bonus. I'll lock it and spin oh. one, see if we get lucky. Yeah, that's good. It's a pretty good bonus roll so far. It's looking pretty good, pretty strong. Mm -hmm. All right. Oh, well, we got the all hit. That's, that's as good as it's getting right there, bro. I don't know. Yeah, we only got two minutes. We only got two minutes. We might as well get in there and get it going. All right, let's go. Get it on, get it on. It's time for big time. What time is it? You all know what time it is. Uh, Wednesday. <laughs> It's Secret Stash Secret Wednesday for a small rare space giveaway. That's right. We're probably going to do it after this. We'll probably get it going. Yeah, this will this. probably be a long map. Oh, I'm speaking of, let me check the time on my hourglasses. Everybody's got an hour? Okay, I'm good to go. Yep, I got about an hour still. And what level dungeon is this? A 29 to 32. I will. I'll keep using them. Yeah, I'll, I'll stay this level. It's good. This guy's got a decoy. 
And this is a cool map. Oh my gosh, it got narrow. Good thing I was actually going down the middle. <laughs> but this is a cool map a lot of people don't get to see very often because not a lot, like no one really plays it. But since they've got, they did say that they adjusted the drops in several dungeons. And this is where I've got one of my legendary NFTs. Yeah. People are like, I don't like this map. I was like, well, I got a $1,700 NFT from this map. Yeah. <laughs> <You know? laughs> They'd like it if they got one of those. All right. I think these people are cool don't like maps, these. Though. Yeah, like... They, they are cool maps, but I think people don't like them because they're it's it's hard to like like smash through them, you know. No, we don't need to go this way. This is not the right way. This is not the right way. Look what you've done. It's good to show the new players, though. Yeah. How to get up these things. Well, pe people get confused. Like, I I've had so many questions uh, for the start of the tour of, like, how do you get past the place with all the blocks? And, and like, I just, I don't get it, man. What do you do? And I'm like, oh, dude, you just got to wait in, in place. The blocks are still there. It, it, it's just they're, they're turning invisible, right? And people think they're going away, I think, is really the, 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 it, the issue. Absolutely. I was like, I'm, how am I supposed to remember that path? <laughs> yeah, right. Exactly. Go forward 10 steps, right 10 steps, 90 degree angle, turn left. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I was like, there's no way I'm going to remember that. Ooh, what these box? What is this? So epoch, treasure chest, treasure chest. So this is not the right way to go, though. Um, I think I have to go back. Let's see, where is that teleport? Okay. Did I open this chest? I mean, we got an Epoch chest bonus and a schematic bonus. We, we don't do. have an inherent NFT bonus. We do not. It's it, it's quite, it's kind of pricey. It's, it's 2,600. Yeah, I, I would probably pass if you're not going to craft a schematic. Yeah, it's, it's, it's kind of pricey. Oh, no, we got to go all the way back. Fuck. Yeah, I'll, I'll get over there and I'll teleport everybody. It looked like we had to go this way, but you had to go the other way and then come back. I have a feeling that there'd be a lot of epoch chests on this map because there's like a lot of like um, spots for spots for treasure chests. Mm -hmm. There we go. I sent you guys a TP. So you TP me right, literally inside of an exploding mine. <laughs> Trying to oh no, really, guys? Trying to take me out, dude. What's going on here? Okay, really's back. All right, so I'm gonna go to the left first because we were already kind of like on this side of the map. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Jack, see my chest. Like I hate those blocks. No, no one likes them. They're. I think they're. They're a cool feature. Like they look cool, and it's kind of a fun like. But I definitely could see for like a newbie how that's confusing. That would be the one thing I would say for sure take out of the new player experience and never put it back. Like that should be not in there. Ooh, there's a Steigen box over here. The Steigen there's box. a lot of Epoch chests on this box. I think this might be the like the new Epoch hunting ma map, honestly. Yeah. There's tons of freaking Epoch chests. I've already seen more on this map than I have in like the last three dungeons. I'm gonna go open that Steigen. I'm gonna go open that Steigen. Look at how big and fat that thing is. 60 tokens. Oh my gosh. Oh, out of level range. No. Uh, uh, all right. Maybe I'm, I, gonna, I look, change I'm gonna open my, it. Why not? I have to go change my pocket watch. Oh, enemies nearby. Oh. Oh, there is an enemy nearby. 
I would open this one because I'm trying to get the Steigen schematics. And I've gotten NFTs out of it before. Alright, fuck it. Opening. You'll probably just get schematic stash. So I would and if you're not crafting 40 of them, then I would I don't I'd probably pass this for 60 tokens if you're not going for schematics. It was 39, but still got nothing. Yep. Nada. I got yeah, the menace leg schematic. The Steigen Menace Leg Schematics. I mean, that's the drop I want. Because I'm halfway there. I'm halfway to craft. You need 40 of those to craft the Mythic. Oof, that's a lot. Activates. Bastion, I choose you. Okay, where are they spawning first? Man, two maps in a row, Bastions, though. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty rough. Oh my gosh, now I can't open the boxes. Let it be a fast bastion. Hey, make sure you guys get in the circle, though. I kept straying, straying from the cause. Oh, there's a bunch behind us. Oh, boy, that almost... Oh, my gosh, my toes were on the edge there. Holy cow. Oh, my gosh, I almost went flying. Bro, Pro ho -ro Pro ho rob Pro ho rob Nice to meet you. I hope I'm saying that close to correctly. It's very nice to meet you. Thanks for coming and chilling with us tonight. Take that decoy, you dumb bugs. And smash. Jump! Please. <laughs> hey, buddy. What's up? You begging for food? Yeah, I thought so. Come here. Come here. Come. Come. I'll give you a little treat, bud. I'll give you a little treat. Custom over here getting he's treating on the job. Yeah, he's he's it's the doggo dinner time. He's telling he's letting me know he's hungry. He's telling me it's time to eat, Dad. Alright, let me go back to the other one. Okay. Far. Yep, so back that way. We can make a right here to go check for treasure chests. There should be two boxes at the end here. All right. And then we just teleport back to the middle and over to the left again. Oh, he almost bounced me off the map. <laughs> I've done that a couple of times. You guys both are jumping in the same spot to the same location. Bink! <laughs> All right. So I'm going to go to the left. And we got one more bastion here. I think we have two more bastions. All right, let me make sure that dog's just... He's had an upset tummy, so I just make sure that he doesn't have to go number two. Yeah. 
activating. Yeah, the the idea of using blockchain for randomness is actually a pretty good one, like provable fair randomness. I built an app uh, for doing giveaways uh, on that. A while back, uh, here using the Wax blockchain actually, which is kind of cool. Thank you guys. Yeah, old dog. Old dog. He's 12 years old. I gotta make sure he's okay. Yeah, no worries. We're just cleaving and chopping away. Alright, I got a decoy at the top of the stairs. We almost got this bastion done. Looks like there's some treasure areas at the top here. Hold, hold the line, hold the line. Yeah, I mean, a lot of people run a lot of social giveaways, right? And so I created a, a Twitter like giveaway picker that uses that use blockchain to pick somebody from a, uh, like different conditions. So it was rather like like retweets and likes. Like you had, to, you had to retweet the tweet and like the tweet, or comment on the tweet. And so there was a bunch of different conditions you could do. Uh, it actually worked pretty good, but the problem was is like kind of to, to make it work, we had to kind of go against Twitter toss because we're essentially scraping data that they don't want scraped, and you can't get it from the API without paying thousands and thousands of dollars. So. I think we have to kill these two bugs on the staircase first. Yeah. There we go. Now we should be able to open it. There should be two little uh, white rooms here. With some treasure chests in them. Come get a bug's fresh decoy. <laughs> there we go. I'm not going to take that teleport yet, but I might come back and take it. A token in the box. Big jump. Nothing in there for me. All right, and then I'll probably go through this teleport on this one. Oh. Mm. Yeah, so that's might be the um, box I would open right there. Oh, that's 28. Kind of expensive. I would probably not open that one. And we do have the Epoch checks bonus. And a schematic increase chance for blue, but you'd still have to craft it. Yeah, I'm going to hit this teleport, see where it goes. Where the heck am I now? Oh, nice. It took us to the last bastion. Oh, that was super nice. Uh -huh. 
That it did. You were supposed to go in that one. We chose wisely. Oh, there's a health bar on the decoy now. That was never there before. You can actually see how much health is on the decoy. Oh, we need a revive. Hold on. Before you activate that Bastion, oh, oh, let's go oh, clear okay. this room and revive. I didn't realize. Maybe why why was there a, a health bar on the decoy up there? But now I can't see it. Interesting. Oh, here's a baby box. This is the one I would open right here. This 400 one right here. Didn't even see that on the way down because it's not on the map, you know? It was hidden. Mm -hmm. So he got some tokens. Got some tokens. Yeah, I'm going to open it. Why not? So no NFTs around the house, but got everyone got some tokens. Yeah. Those are the ones I would risk it on, like the two, three, four hundred dollar ones. I, yeah, those are fine for me. And one box we didn't open. Oh. Oh, out of lever range. That's why. What if your mod chips and stuff fell right off the side of this map? That would be kind of messed up, man, if you got a bunch of loot and it just kept falling off the side of the map. It's happened. <laughs> but you can do it, decoy. Ooh, I need some more mana. Oh, the other, the other quantum fixer does have energizer gates. That's super nice. You're a better quantum fixer than I am. This guy does not have energizers. You can throw down Tree of Life, though. Bankai! That's a cool attack. I like the yeah. sword pedal attack. Yeah, that's pretty cool. It's very unique. All right, baby. No, no, get out of our circle. These bugs spawned in the circle. Capturing at 70% capacity. Alright, so I'll probably go through that teleport that's in the, um, the room that we cleared where the sh revive shrine was. I'll probably take that teleport. And maybe it'll take us to the next quest. Boom. Oh my gosh, you guys all got tons of tokens, except for me. <laughs> Where's my tokens? You always get tokens. You always get the most tokens. You're a token fiend. I want this wimpy drone bug dead. Oh, I knocked him off the map. Mm -hmm. right, I'm going to hit this teleport over here in the room we cleared. Yep, okay, good. Everyone. Ah, they stuck on a barrel. So don't run, keep running after that portal. So it just brought us back there. It was a trap. We gotta hit the entanglers. God. Entanglers are easy though. Yeah, but still, it's just like it's so much running around on this map. 
to these gates. It's weird. Oh no, see? Oh! I came out of the Did gate and fall? fell right over the edge, <laughs> man. I got you. Oh, right out of the gate. It was like, blue! Just a fast <laughs> teleport. Just using the fast teleport system. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Just the good old instant teleport. Yo, Beatry Man, what's up, bud? Yeah, let me throw a decoy down. I'll go get that dog a treat. Get that dog a treat. Oh no, I'm getting beat up. Yeah, thank you, buddy. It's good to see you, Mitri Man. We're hanging out with uh, Crypto Stash tonight, Secret Agent Crypto Stash, and he's going to be doing a small rare space giveaway on the YouTube channel. That's so if right. you guys want to seek and destroy. That is right. We're doing a big giveaway every Wednesday. Having fun with it. Good morning, Trinindo. It's great to see you. Man, we really need to help you get some um, schematics if you're planning on going up the leaderboard this time. Those freaking mythic schematics are worth so many points. So many points for those mythic schematics. I just got one mythic crafted today. I wonder if the points have reflected in my leaderboard account yet. They haven't shown up yet, but they usually show up the next day. And thank you for the doggo tree time. It's always good to spoil the good old dog. What's up, fellas? Yo. Well, hello there. What are you playing in Stash? Playing big time, always, every Wednesday. Uh, big time. I when you, when are you going to start I playing? Tried. I tried. I couldn't get into it. Couldn't get into it, huh? I couldn't get into it. Are you not, not like, a, you don't like, you're not your type of game? Yeah, yeah. It's definitely not everyone's type of game. And when you think about, like, you know, all the gamers out there in Web3 or in crypto, yeah, this is going to be something that a lot of people will enjoy. And then there's going to be people who are like, I just know that, uh, eh. That's, that's everything. Right now? What's up? Are you streaming right now? Yeah. Where at? I'm looking for it. On YouTube. YouTube. <laughs> On YouTube, like always, man. I'm telling you, something's messed up with my YouTube. I didn't get sand. Like I'm, I'm not getting people's notifications. You got the, you got the little bell turned on for me. Oh, boy. I do. I swear, I didn't even get ice. Well, I figured out why I didn't get ices for his because, yeah. Never mind. Anyway, I'll look for it. I'll get it up. You you did something, you broke something. I did something. I, to be honest with you, it's probably my kid. It's him. He did it. He unsubscribed to my channel. <laughs> Come here, buddy. He probably Wait. turned some notifications off or something on me. Lay down. Lay down. That subscribe. I'm like, why is it? Oh yeah, live. Yep, here it is, big time. <laughs> here it I'm is. Just yeah. The objective. Oh, man. Pushing the entangler. All right. We're heading right behind you. Got some Most of those bugs will follow us. There wasn't yeah, like a yeah, big yeah, horn. Yeah, yeah, we got a couple stragglers is all. See, now this looks a little different than what I was playing. What were you playing? I don't know. What Are you sure you're playing big time? Yeah, I don't. Well, I don't think I made it through the tutorial. I think I gave up before I finished the tutorial. Oh, oh yeah. Much more fun after the tutorial. The tutorial is it's like, like hard. once you get to like level 10, 15, and you can join a team of friends and play together and heal yeah. each other, it's, it's a lot more fun. 
I was just talking tonight about how I feel like they, they really do need to remove a couple things from the tutorial. Maybe make it a little a little shorter. A little more. Yeah, instead of like seven quests, grindy. just make it like three quests. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Reduce it down a little bit, man. Be, like like make, it, making it all in one block is, is really one of the biggest problems, you know? It's all in one big setting. Like, you can do some of those tutorial or things. Or tutorial. Like, do you want to play the tutorial? Yes right. or no? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, like, you, you can also... Like, if I've got a stash that can teach me the tutorial, like, as we're going, I don't need to play it. <laughs> There's a lot of so cool yeah, things like you can do idea. with that. So, I mean, you think about it, you know, if people are watching you play, right, and they see how you play and you talk about it and they understand the game, do they really need to go through the tutorial? Well, the, I think the problem was, like, in early versions, with no tutorial, people would join, and, like, a, you know, like, because you start the game at level one, and they would just join a team, and, like, because, like, a, a team of, like, level 40s just needed an extra player to get better drop chances, so they would invite, like, the level one guy, power level them to level 20, you know, 30, and then yeah. by the time, like, you even started playing on a team, like, you had no idea what even your buttons were, like, no one taught you how to, you know, like, skill up your character or assign a skill point, you just got hard carried, you know? So there's got to be a balance. Yeah, no, for sure. There's got to be a balance. I don't think it needs, definitely don't think it needs to be that long. Yeah, it, it, it could be shorter. It could be shorter. For sure. I did play for a while through the tutorial, and I just finally, I was like, you know what? I, I got to do something else. Yeah. All right, we are on the boss fight, so we're going to open these little boxes, clear that last little room. And I'm a big believer of that too like you were saying you know the community aspect of it being able to play with your mates and, and just that yeah. that social aspect is probably what takes it to the next level yeah for like the web 3 space it's a really good co-op game like where you can just like sit down and grind dungeons with your buddies you know you don't have to worry about the earnings and the tokens you guys just play normal dungeons for free you know maybe someone gets lucky and gets an nft but it's like it's still got like a you know a lot of content for just a free game yeah I would agree. But, but you know, for a free game, yes, but for, like, an MMO, maybe not as much as it should, you know? Yeah, I'm going to teleport. What? Oh, dang, I don't think I wanted to teleport. Uh-oh. Nope, I would, did not want to teleport. Oh, uh, whoa, whoa, to the vanquish. <clears throat> All right, I'm going to go start looking for the boss fight. You've led us astray, custom. Yeah, the tutorial, like, I, you know, now that I know what I'm doing, I can usually beat the tutorial in, like, 40 minutes. But I just go, like, mission, boss, mission, boss, mission, boss, you know, out. Like, I don't kill any monsters. I run past everything. I go straight for the missions and the bosses. Yeah. Did we just get a new agent? Oh, we did, But the did, first time yeah. I went through, I think it took me, like, three hours because I was playing a Chronomancer. I didn't know how to play mouse and keyboard, you know, like... Wow, I gotta stop and give mustache love to a new agent. Woe to the vanquished, coming through, joining the agents, man. He's all—he's always been very active in chat here, so good to see he's joining here over on YouTube. Welcome. Awesome. Oh, welcome. Woe so, to Slider the vanquished. Said double Can't agent, yeah. Let's go, dude. Double agent. We gotta see if we can do a double. We need to go to the here. right this time. Do we know where we go? Yeah. How do you freaking get over there? Oh, it's gonna be a floaty, yeah, floaty staircase over here, I think. Oh, those are the best. That's going to be my next crypto name. Floaty Staircase. <laughs> no, what was the one we gave you last time? Loot Goblin? Loot Where Feed. Was... <laughs> loot, fe loot Feed, that's right. Yeah, Loot Feed. Old Loot Feed here. A.K.A. Floaty Staircase. A.K.A. <laughs> Floaty Staircase. All right, where's this path up? It's going to be on this side. It's going to be gonna be on this side this time it's okay bud we're almost at the boss fight he's like but when he's a good buddy we're almost at the boss fight i know you're hungry guys keep pumping those treats out keep pumping the treats the doggo treats make do the thing in the twitch to make it happen all right so we could go clear that way for but I think it's boss fight time. All right, let's do it. We ready. 
All right. Good luck on the boss drops. Into the portal we go. Well, boys, have fun. I'm going to take off, and I'll catch you later. All right, uh, Snooch. Have fun, mean? and I hope Stash wins a cool-ass NFT tonight. Uh, yeah, me too. <laughs> and let's go. Three mega clockies here. Agent out. All later. right, baby. Later, Agent Snooch. Get up, Stash, get up! No! There we go, clock is down. Just a couple more kills. Almost, buddy. I didn't say we were ready yet. I said almost, buddy. <laughs> He's like, what? There we go. <laughs> I know, I know you're hungry. Mission complete. There we go. Nice job, guys. All right. So probably won't do another one of these maps unless we roll really hard for um, Epoch Chess. Yeah. All right, so 32 minutes. Oh my gosh, yeah, not the best tokens. 13 tokens. <laughs> okay. So not the best token dungeon there. Oh my gosh, I beat you in tokens this time. I got 18. Oh yeah, yeah. I almost never beat you. I look at I look at this every time. I'm like, dang, he got me again. Never beat you because you have way better hourglasses than I do. So the chances are that I'm not going to. But this time, this time, I'll take it home. I did get those leg, the leg schematics, but it's probably not really worth it for me to do that. I'm, I'm assuming you need quite a bit of things to, to, to craft those. Like, like stupid amounts of things to craft those. Hourglass is going deep this time. <laughs> Man, I gotta say though that uh, it is sweet that they did it to where your hourglasses can still be on all the time and you don't have to worry about them being used if you're not in a portal, man. That's been so great not to keep taking those damn things on and off for every portal. That was such a pain in the ass. All right, agents. Hey, should we do a giveaway? What do you guys think? Uh, if you're in chat and you're ready for this giveaway right now, let me know what you think. And if you are, oh, it looks like, uh, oh, custom must have had to take off. It looks like custom took off. Let me see. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm still in. Yeah, same with that prestige. Yeah, it was not the best prestige. Thanks, guys. Here. I love you. I got to get care of that dog. All right, man. Thanks, custom. We're going to go do that big giveaway right now. So we're doing the NFT giveaway. If you guys want to get in. On this giveaway, like, yeah, let's do it. That's what everyone's been waiting for. So, like, let's do the giveaway. All right. Okay, let's set. Let's see. We got to get the cuss of the 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 uh, top secret word for you guys. All right. So, in honor of doggo treat time, we're going to make the top secret word, the keyword for today, exclamation treat. Exclamation treat if you want to get in on this rare small space NFT giveaway. $100 NFT for big time. It is like your, your house, your land in big time. And this is what allows you to connect things like Time Warden so you can refill your hourglasses or forges to craft things, right? All the lurkers in chat, they're coming out now. They're like, all right, Stash is on deck. Let's go. Exclamation treat. I'm only going to leave it open for like another minute or so. 
Don't put it more than once, or you're going to get uh, you're going to get booted. Uh, Agent Nightbot, whoo, he is he does not like people who spam the top secret code in chat, and he will put you in solitary confinement. There'll be no gifts for you, no prizes, no giveaways, nothing. You'd be thrown in the box. Yeah, right. A A Agent Tay's right, guys. Look, hit that like button, please. Hit the like button. Hit subscribe. If you guys are not already following the channel and subscribed, it doesn't cost anything. You just, you know, that way you can say, uh, you know, you can say notified of when I'm doing things. And it helps out the channel. Even if you're not going to, you know, hang out that, that often, you know, give us another uh, a subscriber there. Come back. Maybe watch more videos. Hang with us on the ne next live stream. That'd be great. Yeah, smash that like button. Thanks, guys, for the reminder there. Um, all right. So let's see. Take care, Chris. Uh, same as the previous two. Yeah, that was my last one, too. It's giveaway time. So I'm going to leave the party here. And we're just going to go back to town. We're just going to run back to town. Uh, so I'm, I'm, yeah, yeah, in the dog box. So exclamation treat is what you got. That, that's that's your, your chance right now. Exclamation treat. If you want to get in on the giveaway, I'm going to close it here in like another 30 seconds. And then we're going to draw a winner for today's mission into big time. One rare NFT sm small space. Yeah, thanks for running, Lord Misfit. Appreciate it, man. Always a good time, man. We didn't have the bet. We did not have the best luck on the dungeons today. I will say that. We did not have the best luck on the dungeons today. Yeah, definitely could have had better drops, some better luck on the on the you know dungeon tasks. Or right, we got a couple bastions which were like meh. You know, we made some tokens, spent some tokens, <laughs> spent a couple tokens. I mean, we spent some time crystals. Nothing crazy. I, you know, whatever. Oh yeah, Agent Slander's right. Uh, for this giveaway, have your open loot username ready. If you don't already have an open loot uh, account, look at the pin chat. Look at my look at my pin chat. The link is in there to start playing big time and get an account. So I have a, I have a step by step uh, like process that shows you exactly how to get started, right through that link there that's pinned here in chat on YouTube. All right, let's draw this winner. Let's draw this. All right. Once again, if you're not here and you're not present and you don't have the open loot username ready, I will re-roll you. I will re-roll you. Let's do it right now. And the winner is Jigsaw. Agent Jigsaw coming through with that big win. Love to see it go to a fellow agent. Let's go. Mustache love to, to, to Jigsaw for that win. Um, just let me know what your in-game name is Jigsaw TR. Cool. Perfect. See, he was on top of it. I love it. This is how I know. Look, this is how I know he's a good agent, dude. He listens. He listens to instructions. Got me the the username. I don't have to mess around with it, right? I don't have to mess around and try and uh, you know wait around or like is he gonna get it or reroll? He was on top of it. Thank you, Jigsaw. That's that's a that's a agent right there. Uh, and just so you guys know, hey, a real quick, uh, you know, I want to show you guys a little bit something here too uh, before we go. Um. Because we're done playing big time, but I want to show you a little something about the agents program. Uh, if you guys don't know about the agents program, it is like my membership program. It's like my my top tier elite gamer community. And so you guys can go to that link that's in chat. I just posted in chat right now, or Agent Nightbot did. And uh, it is this is a link on my website, but it tells you all about the agents program. Uh, you can go there, and it takes you all the way. Well, it's me six really, but this is through Discord. You can do it on YouTube as well. So the agents program is like a monthly subscription where you get extra perks, which are include things like playing games with me directly, uh, being able to jump in and get uh, early play test access to a bunch of different games. The games you see me playing all the time that I get early access to. So you get early access to all these NFT games. You're also getting whitelist access to a bunch of drops, right? Uh, we do NFT just straight drops where our, our, our you know agents every once in a while. 
And uh, then we, we you get exclusive giveaways too. So we have agent giveaways inside of Discord. They're just for our, our elite agents, right? For our elite agents. Uh, so a lot of really good value there. Uh, tons of, 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 of value that you get as, a, as an elite agent. So check out that link there, guys, and go, uh, go think about, consider being a, an elite agent. Like I said, you get a bunch of cool monthly perks, and, um, and that, that includes other things like little emojis and things like that, right? So uh, it, it definitely is, for someone who's hanging around a lot and is playing these games already, the value is definitely there, right? J just with like the whitelist and the early access and the NFT drops, even just that right there is, is, is tons of value every month, so... All right, Jigsaw, congratulations, man, once again. And thank you, all you agents. Another successful mission. I love it. Another successful mission. Uh, we did it. And uh, I couldn't have done it without you guys, without you guys being here. It's always fun. Uh, I know, obviously, i got to give a big shout-out and thanks to Custom TV. Uh, make sure you guys go follow him over on Twitch. He's, it's it's C-U-S-T-O-M-E, custom with an E, uh, custom TV. He is a great dude, a lot of fun game with this guy, super knowledgeable about big time, way more than me. And, you know, he's got great friends, people who are always bringing on these this, these prestige runs. So i got to give a big shout out to him and all of the rest of the big time players that have joined us today. Uh, always fun with them. Always great to run with them and uh, get some big time tokens, you know, have some fun. Still looking for that NFT though, guys. Still got to get the NFT. But we're popping collars and we'll be back next Wednesday for another big time Wednesday. Make sure you guys check out tomorrow, Top Secret Thursdays. We're playing brand new games, ones you never heard about, ones you may want to invest in early. That's what the show is all about. We'll see you guys then. As always, this grieving never happened. Secret Agent Stash, over and out.